Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Moon Diary and today I'm watching Attack on Titan Season 1 Episode 2. If you guys can get this video to 50 likes in 12 hours, I'm gonna release the next episode of Attack on Titan tomorrow. The last episode we started the journey. Uh, it ended with a gruesome scene of Ellen's mom getting eaten by the Titan and Ellen watching it. They animated it so beautifully for such a morbid scene. And the main takeaway from last episodes were uh, the basement. Uh, there's something in the basement that Ellen's dad was doing some sort of experiment, I think. And it was really convenient that Ellen's dad had to leave, uh, leave right then uh, when the uh, Titans attacked. So I think he's up to something. He probably knows a lot more about what's going on with the Titans and maybe the what happening with the colossal day and such so that's gonna be interesting to see how that storyline progresses with a further let's check out episode two of season one play so it's only been a century since the titans appeared if they were on the verge of extension how did they build this settlement so fast and is there any other settlement out there in the world as well Will we ever go to those places? I wonder. Uh, this is so fucked up. <laughs> Everything is getting destroyed. And these guys are still preaching. It's not gonna end well for him. He's drawing attention to himself. These guys look so creepy. <laughs> oh, this scene. There used to be an old AMB uh, that I think enemies got talent that had this scene. <laughs> Oh, oh, imagine getting pulled by your head. <laughs> Everyone's panicking. With him preaching and everything that's going on. This is so mortifying. Yeah, God won't save you. Ah, uh, we're back with our main guys. Eren is... Eren was shocked and now he's pissed off. His hatred for the titans will just grow and grow. He was already really enraged. This is just gonna amplify it. Oh fuck. Saying that to a kid. Because you were weak. That way you couldn't protect your mom. Yeah. He was weak as well. He didn't have the courage. In the end he's just blaming himself. But he also gave them the reality check. Uh, Mikasa remembers what happened to with them, her parents. Mikasa's bad omen. <laughs> yeah, people are trying to get to the next wall. Ooh, that's a really cool tram style boat. Oh yeah, this wasn't actually the main wall. It was like a, it's like a bait to attack the titans. They're already overboard. They can't. Not all of them are gonna be able to get on the boats either. Uh, Armin's such a good kid, he's uh, worrying about his friends. But they have seen some shit. They're all afraid, they're all shocked. It's already overboarded. Anyway, they can try to get on the boats, trying to survive. Yeah, people are jumping. Oh. The gates are going down. They're gonna retreat. Couldn't they make just uh, human sized doors? So that the humans can just go through. Why did they only have the one huge door for everything? Like carriages and human, a single door. <laughs> oh, something big is approaching. Oh, yeah. Is that is the armor titan, right? Yeah, I had forgotten about this guy. Oh, look at the outer coating he has. I think this guy is probably also a human. Otherwise, they wouldn't put this much emphasis on him. He's a unique variant. The cannons won't work. <laughs> In the past, I heard that the armor titan was based on Brock Lesnar, the UFC fighter, WWE wrestler. Oh, <laughs> he broke through it. He just shoulder tackled it. Oh, a huge hobo. Yeah, look how much steam. He's exhausting. It's like he's almost a robot. A mecha. Yeah, Wal Maria got. So the Titan, the armor Titan broke through Wal Maria, right? Yeah, the regrets. Nothing will be the same anymore. 
He wanted to grow up fast. He wanted to see the world. We wanted to see what was outside. The outside has invaded you instead. Yeah. They are not coming back. He's so enraged. He lacks strength. Because humans are weak. Are humans weak? Or are you weak? You're just projecting that the entire human race is weak. Uh, he's determined. He's gonna kill them all. Look at that face! So much rage in those eyes! So did everybody evacuate from Walmaria? Oh, Aaron's dead. He's coming back? So he didn't know? I don't know how, to, uh, how I feel about his dad. I'm not sure if I trust him or not. This is the scene uh, that... I think he's injecting him with a titan experiment or something. Yeah, after mom died, you lost it. So, did he come back and they spent some time good together? Yeah, get the key to the basement. Okay. So, we're missing a bit of a story in, in between this, right? Yeah, this is the part I don't understand. Is Mikasa also part of it? Is Mikasa working with uh, Anna's dad or something? She knows something? Yeah, because the key is with him and uh, last we saw it was with his dad. So the dad gave him. There's a time gap in between. They're giving out rations. Oh, it's that girl. <laughs> I mean, got them food. He's such a nice kid. Uh, you should feed the kids <laughs> first. Keep the next generation alive. <laughs> Faha. Those assholes. Oh. <laughs> this is not gonna end well. It's gonna eat him. <laughs> and another good kick to him. Yeah. You guys don't know what the Titans are like. They are talk big, but they work in the interior of the of the walls. He is a good talker. He did a good job defusing it. Fucking asshole. What you gonna do after you go back? Kill the Titans? Don't throw the food. They already don't have enough. You need to live if you want to fight. Survival is the most important thing. Uh, again with the cattle energy. He really has that cat energy. Oh, good for Mr. Kasa. He needed a fucking beat down. He was too, he was too emotional. Uh, yeah, you guys got carried away. Yeah, you guys need to get strong. It's a matter of survival. <laughs> Eat and survive. This scene reminds me of when uh, Toka made Keneki eat the flesh. It had the same vibe. <laughs> oh, they went back to harvest more food. Uh, they were just sent to for a death mission. No way they're gonna get be able to get the Almaria back. Two hundred and fifty thousand. Oh, over a hundred only survived. Far, <laughs> uh, them being killed got at least <laughs> they really trying to see the brighter picture in that fucked up situation. Oh, his grandpa also was one of those. He's enlisting, and they're gonna follow. Receive the proper training. Yeah. Wherever you go, Mikasa is going to follow. Her job is to make sure you are alive. You stay alive. <laughs> and the start of a great journey. Oh, they've grown up. <laughs> you worthless cattles. Worse than cattles. They can train for three years. The Mikasa glow up. Eren looks the same. 
but his voice got deeper <laughs> uh so they're gonna go for training for three years the government just killed off like a 250,000 people because of the uh, food shortages and they also sent out people to harvest the food and bring them back uh, I didn't remember that at Wal Maria got breached uh, by the Armatan and I, I, I forgot about it. I only remember the, uh, I guess, the small uh, bait wall. Uh, I thought only that one got breached, but Wal Maria also got breached. So the third wall has been breached and the tightness are still there. Couldn't people live on top of the walls? <laughs> uh, I guess they don't want to damp the wall or anything like that. Maybe that's why. Uh, I, because the on top of the wall there are a lot of space as well, right? But how bad is Wal Maria infested by the Titans right now? Maybe they can use the wow, use the fields just after the gate or something. Uh, this is a good episode. This, uh, this was the journey, uh, the start of the journey uh, for Eren, Mikasa, and Armin. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Help me reach 200 subscribers. That we much appreciated. And see you guys next time for more Attack on Titan. Goodbye.